All right. Well, Star Wars may have predicted the future in a sense. I'm talking about holograms. The Microsoft HoloLens is the first fully untethered holographical computer headset. We have screens everywhere and interact with technology via phones, laptops, tablets, and many other devices. We are constantly looking away from our environment to interact with screens. Microsoft HoloLens's mission, however, is to take these interactions with screens and make it more personal by having your computer needs appear in your environmental surroundings. This will make the amount of time we spend on technology more real. Let's hope this gets rid of the computer slouch. Holograms are quite complex. Like many devices in our world, holograms are made from fractals and waves. No, not that kind of wave. No, not that one either. Really? Nah, here's what I'm talking about. Holograms are made by interference patterns in light waves. When the crest of one wave meets the trough of an opposing wave, the wave peaks cancel out and cause interference patterns. Waves interfere destructively when one wave's crest runs into the other wave's trough, and vice versa. In that case, the combined wave has a lower amplitude than either of the waves did before. With perfectly destructive interference, the waves actually disappear completely. With lasers, these interference patterns hit film and make tiny suspended mirrors that reflect light waves, creating a three-dimensional image. The entire hologram could be produced with even the smallest part of the film that the image was recorded on. Holograms back in the 1970s were thought of just another form of art, like photography. As photography turned into videography, and like to television, holograms might create a whole new world of virtuality and reality. In Dubai, people are enjoying virtual zoos where they can interact with lifelike holographic animals rather than keeping living animals in captivity. Prisoners who have been behind bars for over 20 years are now using virtual reality headsets in order to help them reassimilate with the modern world. This will help with the cultural shock of using debit cards, cell phones, self-checkout, as well as social situations in the outside world. Researchers at Tokyo University have come up with touchable holograms. Ultrasonic waves create a pressure sensation on the hand of the user touching the projected hologram. This technology could be used to prevent the spread of germs in hospitals. If doctors and sick patients are able to click holographical switches rather than physical ones, there will be no surface for the germs to stick to, therefore not contaminating anyone. NASA is also using holography to simulate planets. With the data from the Curiosity rover, humans are able to explore Mars holographically and walk on the surface as if they were truly there, even though it's over 100 million miles away. Holography is probably going to replace technology as we know it, but before that happens, you should like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Facebook. Lay it, lay it down, let me see your hand, show me what you got. You're always talking, but you're not playing It doesn't match your face Gotta find my way away from this place Can you take me now? I, I want it, I want it real Are you afraid of me now? Are you afraid of me now? Do you feel